record. All right. All right, all right, all right. All right. So here I am playing some Dead Rising. I'm going to turn that off. That's kind of annoying. Uh, we're playing some Dead Rising 2 on the PS4, mainly because I heard the Xbox One port is kind of crap in a sense. It's just a port and it's not really optimized. So I was like, okay, cool. So, because it apparently has like stopping issues and stuff like that where it will crash midway through game. So I'm just like, okay, I'll just stick around on the PS4 port and see if that is working fine. Originally, I was gonna just uh, shove my uh, Dead Rising 2 game. I'm pretty sure I mentioned this in K0. I was just gonna launch my Dead Rising 2 game and pretty much just like say fuck it, you know, and see hopefully it's backwards compatible. It is not, which is a real damn shame. So, just gonna restart, sorry. I played, uh, I only did like the, I only got Chuck up to like level 6, level 6, 5. Oh, yeah, level 6, uh, because that's like more or less how much XP I got from K0, so yeah. I got like two trophies, which is like uh, Father of the Month, give Katie a toy, and then uh, it needs more training cells, which is like a uh, tumble card thing. Spore is weird because uh, you see the chainsaws in the cut, in the in the cutscene, right? They're they're yellow, in game they're blue for some reason. I have absolutely no idea. I've not checked uh, on three on the Xbox One because, like I say, I heard I own it on Xbox One. I was originally gonna play on Xbox One, but then with the whole situation, it's like, oh, Dead Rising Two doesn't really work too well. Like some of the ports don't work too well, like Dead Rising Two and off the record. Have issues where they're like they crash mid-game, so you always have to be constantly saving. Uh, to be fair, I that may be an issue on this console. I may not have played as long as I need to in order for the game to crash, but I'll just try to keep that in mind. I guess you suck at killing zombies, otherwise she'd still be around. <laughs> kind of long on um, just a bit. Save it for the show, shithead. Zombie. Took our Willamette. They took our Las Vegas. But tonight, America, we're going to get a little payback. America's 
I like to see the, <laughs> the fucking... The fucking subtitles are still delayed. Love to see you. All right. Three, two, one, boo! Look at that. Chainsaws are blue for some reason. What the fuck? Why? Why are the chainsaws blue? They should be yellow. Really weird. I guess that's like one noticeable big thing on this board. I'm not sure about the like Xbox board. board. Uh, I don't know if I'll up switch uh, to the Xbox One board at any point in time. I was, I was thinking that uh, uh, playing, uh, the, playing this on the Xbox 360 because I do own a physical copy of the 360 so I did play a good bit. I originally wanted to um, uh, like, um, freak it out a little bit. I know this board, the, the zombie ragdoll physics is a little bit wonky. It's really odd. So hopefully it's not, it's not too bad. If I ever do run into like issues with the actual game stuff, I can only switch over to a different port. So after I pretty much at this point own all the ports, more or less. I own the PS4 360 and Xbox One, so I can switch between them if I need to. Also PC. I like think they're saying that, and I, I won. So we just got started, people! Yeah, first place, for God's sake. It's just beginning! So right now, let me hear you! Make some noise! noise. Certainly, you know, there's not really much story from between K0 and the Rising 2. Which I'm kind of surprised about, like, between those two games. It's just pretty much, hey, drive over to the sunset and then it's like, boom, we're in Fortune City, essentially. My hair's fucked up. Does it? I lost my family in Willamette. I'd rather just have them back. I forgot to change my hair. I wanted to get the uh, quote unquote Shaun of the Dead outfit, which I do own on the 360, but not hey, on the newer consoles. You know where the green rooms are? Yeah, take the elevator up a floor and then straight down the hallway. You can't miss it. <laughs> My hair is all fucked up. <laughs> I have the psychopath hair right now, so it's like, whatever. So yeah, I'm level 6. You got some extra cash. I got some extra cash on the side. Because cat, you kind of... You don't really need cash, but it is useful occasionally. I got my chucks on too, man. In real life, you always be seeing me with the chucks on. Your Frank West. Frank West? Look at Chuck. <laughs> Wrong game. But yeah, hopefully th this game won't have 
won't be terribly hopefully this game is not bad on the on the newer gen consoles you think like newer gen consoles can run it as long as it's port properly but i heard the the xbox one port isn't really optimized properly it's just pretty much just like slapped on like i like you could you saw from the main like menu terror's reality is there which was the online stuff. I never really played it. Obviously, kind of wanted to, but I heard there's no one, no one really online anymore, which is kind of a shame. Maybe one day I'll, I'll, I'll get people to play with me, like uh, Adam or Oscar. Adam, Oscar, get the get the old school bro boys back in here, you know. But besides that, hopefully this game is gonna run. More or less well on the on the PS4 pro on the PS4 because my thought process is like okay it's a PS like this game chair was released on uh, Xbox Three Xbox Three <laughs> P uh, PlayStation Three it was released on PlayStation Three uh, which is like completely different hardware than the than the PS4 and the PS4 and the PS3 don't really have backwards compatibility so thought process is okay you may have to like um, like there's a there's a little bit a little more finessing as to be done in order for it to run on like this newer console. So hopefully this port isn't uh, isn't suffered with too many of the issues that the Xbox One port has. But I don't know. I I didn't really see much discussion of the PS4 port online. So who knows? But I but what I've seen Xbox port. It not really the greatest. Not sure if that's been fixed or not, but yeah. And then, of course, I'm gonna be switching over to play uh, what's got a uh, Case West after after this. I share directly after this, or like what have you. So here's where normally the uh, the tr the what's gonna call it the. Uh, Will pop in and be like, Oh, you can save your project in the restroom and all this sort of stuff. It still suffers from that issue where you can see like certain items like that, like saves and survivor stuff, which kind of does suck. Still suffers through that issue. Well, who do we have here? Mr. Chick Green, a terrorist reality store. I guess you think you are a big man, big man show. What? Uh, well, I'll bet nothing about you. Personally, big. Tuck my my dick. Uh, be a tra Holy shit! I was about to say you're taller than me, but you have heels on. Okay. Well, there is something pretty big about you too. Mm, yes, but no. Come on. Uh, or maybe you just don't know how to. R maybe wait. What? <laughs> maybe or maybe you just don't know how to ride. Uh, go on, Chuck. Take your money and run. Okay. Excuse me. Get out of my dressing room, Chuck E. Trying to pick a girl. Naked, wait, wait, trying to take, take a peek at naked girls. Do you have a coffee machine? Fuck, why the fuck do you have a coffee machine? I don't. Surprisingly enough, they were actually at the, um, at the Nevada outbreak during Chuck's, like, motocrossing. When Chuck Green was basically just motocrossing, they were pretty much in the VIP section with Tyrone King and stuff like that, but then uh, King was, uh, TK was basically just like, hey, get the fuck out of here and got his limo and just basically, like, book it. Yeah, she's pretty much just saying the same thing. And that's pretty much their whole thing. I guess that's why Chuck, like, that's, I guess that's one of the reasons why, uh, TK signed Chuck to Terror Reality to be like, hey, I saw you doing more cross. Maybe you could do this, you know, get some payback for what happened back in Will or not Willamette, back in um, Nevada. Surprisingly enough, that's where I'm actually going to go next month. Being forced to go, kind of like uh, when I had to go to LA, so I'm going to be annoyed as fuck. I'm probably not even going to do shit. Apparently, there's going to be much more more to do over there because they have a shark tank, or shark tank and stuff like that. I'm going to be on the strip, but I didn't do much in. Uh, LA, I, I don't think I'm going to do much in Nevada, so it's like, who knows. Because she wants to see some BTS, and I'm just like, the fuck, I don't, I don't care. 
But that's the big drag long. The ladies were a little disappointed in your performance tonight, Chuck. But you must get that a lot. Nice. Good night, ladies. Man, it looks like I just woke up. Was well, that that basically just defines me 24/7? I normally don't even do my hair. That pretty much just looks like me. Chuck, Chuck right now just looks like me. My hair is usually just messed up. I just hand comb to one side, and that's pretty much it. Pretty much it. Occasionally, a cup of water, you know, because my hair gets all like fucking crazy and shit like that. Maybe I'll pick up Chuck's. Uh, Chuck, yeah, maybe I'll pick up Chuck's jacket before I go to Nevada, so I can wear it. Oh could be like, I'm Chuck oh Green in Nevada. And also get the Russian like, good for you. Now, we got zombies. Pick up these real quick. Uh, no, not Sean. I'm pretty sure those are Sean, uh, Sean of Them references right there. Like Sean and his uh, buddy Tyler. Not really much you do here. The camera is uh, to save anyone here. Unless you, of course, mod the game, but you know. This guy got dragged in. He's gonna yeah. head over here. Katie? Katie! Get off her! Yeah. Oh my god, that pop. Stay calm, okay? We need to get out of here. So hang on tight. Bam. Can't really do much. You can only kick survivors. The survivors go on and kick them. Oh, he's dead. Another crap here. It kinda sucks you can't really do much here. I'm gonna break this. I don't think I can break this for Katie on me. There's a cutscene if you do uh, lose your health here. Uh, if you did play the Terror's Reality stuff, I'm pretty sure the winning jacket or some shit is like here as well. Like in one of these like store things. But you, you can't come here later on. During the mission progression. Hello, anybody home? Anyone there? Hey, yo, what's up? Why are you just chilling there? I'm not sure if I'm gonna play the uh, off the record on console. Probably not, cause I want I want to have classic Frank West Willamette. <laughs> I want to play classic Frank West Willamette, but the. the I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not much of a keyboard controller for like Dead Rising games because it does feel a bit odd. Oh no, not again. Well, if she did. It's the guy from Lincoln Park, RIP. I forget.
be okay now, Katie. Uh, I can't get a signal. Why? Why can't I get a signal? She... she was... she was looking right at me and they had her and I... I couldn't do anything! She went down without a sound and I... I had to get out of there. I just... ran. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on a second, son. Listen, it's an existing condition, all right? It's okay. It happened a long time ago. It's only a matter of time before she turns. Hey, don't worry. I've got Sombrex. Yeah, well, you better have a lot, because there ain't none here, and the rescue ain't coming for three days. Three days? Yeah, the reserves will already be mobilizing. But their first priority is to quarantine the city, and that takes time. They'll enter the city at first light three days from now. That's the standard procedure. So we're stuck here? There's a couch in the security room. Why don't you take her in there? It's quieter. Thanks. I was gonna get some, right after the show. We still have time. Where are you gonna get it, Dad? You let me worry about that, okay, kiddo? I know where you can get some. How long have you been listening? Don't worry, I won't say anything. There's a pharmacy in the Royal Flush Mall. I'm Stacy Forsythe, by the way. I'm Chuck, and this is Katie. No, but if you find one, I suggest you take this. That way we can keep in touch. There's closed circuit cameras all over the city. These monitors are playback only, but I'll keep an eye on them. Chuck, if you find anyone alive out there... I'll do what I can. Keep an eye on my daughter, okay? Nah, 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 nah. God, they still love their your, their guitar solos, don't they? I'm just looking at the price of Green's jacket. It's like a uh, 139 looks like 139.99 plus shipping is probably like fifteen dollars. So it was that hundred like I think 140, 40 ish. So now we're in the game since this is the um, what's the word I'm looking for the uh, next gen ports, quote unquote. Uh, you can get all the DLC just right here. Bonuses, you got the ninja, the psychopath. I'm just rocking the hair right now. And, uh... Special Ops and Sports Band. I may just change back his hair because... Uh, actually, you know what? I should have just rock messy hair chuck instead of just, like... My full luscious hair, Chuck. Hmm. I, I guess I'll just chill with. 
Actually... Fuck it. <laughs> give me, give me messy hair Chuck. Hell yeah. Let's go. Chuck spit, this Chuck's seen some shit, man. It's like... Like, sure, he must be using a lot of, like, uh, what's my call it? A lot of gel and stuff. But you think, with all the shit he's seen, you think he'll get his hair dirty. Or messed up. He's probably being grabbed, pushed, you know? Hell yeah. So there, there are a bit of carryovers from like the second game, or I mean the first game, which I'll mention here in a bit. The unnecessary cutscene is unnecessary. So this is kind of more or less the beginning part for us right here. Urchins, yeah. Chuck, I found the travel brochure for Fortune City. It says you're right now. Wait, what? Right now you're in the Royal Flush Plaza, which is basically our like beginning point from where uh, Dead Rising One. Basically, how Dead Rising One had the. Um, it's not the entrance plaza. Fuck, I don't remember the name of the plaza anymore. Basically, where you can get all your, like, you can get your like healing arms over there. It's coffee creamer. It's a good old orgy. The only orgy you can get right off the bat is like that one right there. Uh, you can get some XP here real quick. You can just grab the mallet do that. Uh, I'm not uh, breaking these with any other weapon counts. Does it count? I don't break already. Oh, it does break. Okay. Punch bonus. Either that I didn't really technically punch him. Come on. It works with the hammer. Okay, it doesn't work with the hammer. It works with the it works with the axe apparently. Come on, break. Okay, apparently breaking it with the axe works not with the hammer, which is weird. I don't know if that's a uh, Oh, that sounded really f weird to me. I was like, what the fuck? Um, so yeah, breaking with the axe works for some reason. Uh, there's... A fucking clothes sand which you can spin, which I'll, I'll do in a second. You can get XP from rolling a 7. So if you get lucky and hit a 7. Uh, what is that? 3. So I just need to hit what, like... Come on, you seven. Nope. That's uh, that's way too high. All right, close. You can get a, a quick spin the um, display rack real quick if you just head up to the second part of the uh, what is this? It says Royal Flush Plaza. It's not the name of the store. Let's see here. All right. Now there's two of these here. Just quickly spin this. There we go. Display rack. Bo spin bonus. Spin this real quick too. As well as um, you can get some spray paints and there's some uh, Zombrex posters around. Uh, you can spray paint and it gives you like I think a thousand like, PP points. There's a brow sword up here as well. Yeah, you pick up. You really, you don't really need to pick up this broadsword because after you, uh, combo weapons are introduced, uh, necessary doing stuff like that is not super necessary. Pick up money. Look at that. This is what I was talking about, where uh, kind of has suffers that that thing where uh, K Zero kind of day, where it's like you you see the the survivors pretty empty. It's like kind of breaks immersion a little bit. Also, zombie, zombie physics in this game. I think they got switched out with the uh, normal uh, zombie physics from Terror's Reality because they they're rad dogs, rag dogs, rad doll physics are like 
amped up for some reason in the story campaign. Or in the campaign story, whatever the fuck you want to call it. Section of the actual real game. Just here looking for some Zombrex. Well, you're definitely gonna need some painkillers when I'm done with you. Talking to you is giving me a headache. Oh, yeah? What say you give me some money, and I'll go get some for you? Yeah, give us some money, Grandpa. We'll help you out. How about it, Grandpa? You got any money? Got any money? Alright, looters are a new aspect of Dead Rising. Two, and is in off the record as well. They essentially is that the guy with the, no, that's, you're the one with the, with the flashlight. No, I broke it. God damn it. I wanted another flashlight. So, go make a quick money hacker. Whoop, bomb. So survivors in this game are much better, which is great. I thought they were gonna kill me. It's okay, you're safe now. Are you hurt? I think I am okay. Thank you so much. You got here before they, before they. What? Okay. <laughs> Listen, there is a safe house where you be safe. Follow me, and I'll take you there. And she has joined. You get PP for it. Which is great. Oh, yeah, I didn't want to drop that. Jackpot. Got Zombrex. Which is basically... Hello? So you found some Zombrex. It's too early to give Kitty and you just make sure you're back yeah, between 7. Kind of want to get the hygiene max. Mainly because, you know, quarantine stuff like that. But, <laughs> what the hell? Did you see? Look at that. Dude, really, look at that. Dude. This looks so weird. But... Kind of gives him a mouth, which is kind of odd. Like when he talks and shit, it's like <laughs> it's like a mouth on the mask, and it's like really weird. Let's go, lady. So the value of this game, any money in front of the slot machine gives you. A win, essentially. So that's another thing you should keep in mind. See if I can kill a zombie real quick. What the fuck? <laughs> that, uh... That blood spatter. It's kind of a shame they didn't upgrade the Playboys. Here, though, you can't complain, man. Playboys are pretty nice, you know? Nothing but the good... Good shit, you know? Stick to me! Come on. I mean, it can't be worse than Dead Rising 1 uh, Survivors. You know, it was, it was complete trash. On the expression on the PS4, because I swear, they, their AI, like, either got dumber or, like, they did something to the AI in that game. Because I, I remember not having as much trouble as I did with Dead Rising 1. Like, it was just terrible. Like, I don't even know why it was that terrible. Oh my god. These fucking lungeons, man. One thing I, I am b kind of bothered by is, like, even if I wiggle the stick really fast, like, it, it doesn't... I feel like it doesn't register as well as it, as it did with the original port of this. It's kind of a shame. I was on button mashing. Button mashing feels kind of odd to me too. Cause I have, a, I have a decently like quick button mash. Good thing about this game, about the sequel is you can see that now it actually tells you when survivor is actually next to you, which is great. Thank you so, so much. 
Oh, those guys were stealing everything they were saving my life. Where on earth did you find them? Never mind. I don't want to know. There's still people alive out there. We can't afford to have any infected in here. He says that, yet, um... He, he, I guess he just made an exception for me and Katie. 1,000 PP point, points for escorting. Couple card acquired. Machete and broom. Broom pole weapon. Nice. Machete and a push broom. Now we're level 7. Kind of wishing a... Uh, I'm going to quick rewrite that real quick. It's kind of hoping for a uh, new attack. Like one I can actually use. So I can get the... Uh, like, Shaun of the Dead kind of outfit. I don't remember the, the proper name for it. In order to you need to kill like, a certain number of zombies with your bare hands. My goal was to, like, try to get an, uh, to the certain point where I can actually start, like, getting the uh, good like, attacks. Now there are, uh, there's actually a boss fight you can actually trigger right now, uh, the one with the uh, snowflake and, uh, what's his name? I don't even remember his name. Uh, actually I don't remember one on top. Actually I can just drop the guitar, I don't really need the guitar. Here I do like the guitar's, uh, ultimate, uh, attack. Something you can quickly do is, uh, there's some, there's some Zombrex posters here. You spray paint these, they give you XP, just make sure you, you keep track of which ones, because they don't tell you, uh, which ones are actually, like, you know, hey, you spray painted them, because it does leave, they do get removed after you leave the actual area. Well, there's one there, there's one upstairs, there's one over here, and the smaller ones do count. Uh, you can examine these and they give you combo, combo cards as well. I don't think you can examine it, exam, examine just yet. Because we haven't gotten the um, I could do this all day. combo. Or not, we haven't gotten the main ski yet, which is the, the, the main thing. I can't remember exactly where. Uh, I think it's Americana Casinos where, where they're at. God damn it. Americana Casino. Americana Casino somewhere else. Uh, I really want to go there. I don't. God fucking damn it. Get off of me. Sack of shit. Let's go and get some coffee cream real quick. I should go and go to the America Casino because I believe there's Zombrex over there. Pretty sure there is one. There's some Zombrex you can get without having to pay uh, money for it. Also, you can also come here to get a broadsword as well. So if you ever need a broadsword or just like a weapon in general, a decent sword or a decent weapon, there's like one always here. It is easier to get than going upstairs and grabbing it. Oh, is it not here? I guess it's not triggered yet. I think it's triggered automatically in off the record. Off the record, they change a few things. But you can you can uh, actually uh, change or not change. You can um, get quick. Uh, oh yeah, I wanted to do the the dummy thing. That's what I wanted to do. I don't remember what I wanted to do. Um, you get quick juices over here. Quickly, just do that. I think it's just two beers. Two beers is like painkillers, and then it's like a, I think a beer and a. Um, oops, there we go, painkiller. I think a be uh, a wine vodka is like a quick step, I believe. Excuse me. It's, it's been a little bit. I'm trying to remember. Oh no, that's a what is that? That's a randomizer. Fuck no. Where's a whiskey? Maybe it's just a beer and wine. Beer and wine is a quick step, I think. 
Because randomizers, you can get a random perk, but I also can make you, like, cute. It's a beer. Why need a beer? Hell yeah, that's a quick step right there. Platinum strip. Oh, that's outside. Okay. Try to remember some stuff. Gonna pick up that cash real quick. We do, we do have a little bit of time, so you can explore around, grab stuff, get some quick PP stuff. Uh, there are little mini games like bull riding. Uh, there's a thing where you can get some money as well. I'm trying to remember. What is it? It's not quite time. I think this is it buttons or is it like direction? I almost fucked that up. I think it's. I, I'm pretty sure it gets. Yeah, it gets harder the more the more you do it. After certain points, uh, it's counted as like completed in quotation marks. Yeah, up here is where the very zombie breaks. Yeah, you have to jump over those, and then there's also a gambling magazine, I believe, or it's like a coupons for the uh, coupons for the uh, what's gonna call it. Uh, I didn't, I didn't reach. God damn it! There's coupons for the uh, the, the stores that are gonna be opening up in here in a little bit. I'm gonna try to get the zombrex real quick, at least. I don't have to worry about it later. I, can't, I don't remember how many Zombrexes you actually need to give Zadie, Zadie, Katie, in this game. It's been a little bit, so... Hopefully it's not too much. I think you can make do like, three... Yeah, there's bargaining. I think it's like 10% off, right? Yep. I should probably keep that on. This axe I don't really need right now. Actually, Bingo. I do want the axe. It does count as a melee weapon for some reason. I'm going to actually drop the bat. Uh, it's tr I'm trying to remember. I'm trying. To, it's, I've been out of all the games, out of all the Dead Rising games I've played. I, I feel like I've played this one the most. The only thing is, uh, I don't quite remember too much. Is the weird thing. I played this game the most. You think I'll remember it the most? But to be honest, I don't really remember too much from this game. I'm gonna try to get that quick PP bonus real quick for the uh, the dummies. So I broke one of them with the sledgehammer. For some reason, the axe counts as like me using my fist. So you can put on the boxing gloves, you can put on the MMA gloves, and they they count. Why are the blood effects going black? I'm gonna break down here. What? Seriously, why are the blood effects like that? Come on. Come on. Alright, down here. Be you breaking. You're about to break. Oh, I didn't even get the... 
I didn't even get the PP thing. That's a shame. Hold on. There's a magazine here. I don't remember what it does, though. I don't know if it's the bargaining one or is that the health one. That's health. I think it's this one. No, that's combat. Okay. We should probably make our way back. What a real shame is like I'm looking at <laughs> Dead Rising 2 like jackets. The real shame is like all of them have like that little piece of leather in the middle, the zipper. Which some leather some leather jackets have, but it's like it's not really necessary. And then they have like extra bit of of uh, leather on like the the back end. I'm trying to point at it if I can because you can't see me pointing. I'm too- I'm probably gonna be too lazy to edit, so I'm just like, fuck it.